We've noticed hotels really are the sort of family shelters now for families with nowhere to go. As the need for affordable housing continues, many Metro Atlanta families are turning to motels and hotels as a last resort. The price for those by each night yeah. so high, though, that it makes it harder to pay off debt or save for permanent housing. Liza Lucas shows us how one program is trying to help families. It's all new this morning. It's the shoes lined up by the door, the love notes left for her kids, that show Francesca Rivas she's home. We're very happy to be here. It's space, you know, we're not in one room. With it's a mind. different reality than what Francesca faced earlier this year, living out of a Gwinnett County motel room with her two kids, the single mom trying to make ends meet, stuck in what was supposed to be a temporary solution. I was working two jobs. Somehow still, I'm only left with $100 to my name. It's a cycle the team at St. Vincent de Paul knows well. Families living paycheck to paycheck, relying on motels and hotels for housing, especially since the pandemic. These hotels are very expensive. You know, we are finding a lot of our applicants now can't even afford the hotels anymore. They're actually sleeping in their cars with their children because there isn't anywhere else to go. And that's where the Motel to Homes program comes in. The St. Vincent de Paul team helps families move from extended stay motels to more stable housing, offering financial support for deposits and first month's rent. We saw our requests increase by 40% over the course of the pandemic. And the need continues to grow amid limited affordable housing options. In Metro Atlanta, you need to earn more than $50,000 a year to cover rent of a basic two bedroom apartment that's typically around $1,200. Yet around a quarter of Georgia renters can only afford half that amount. If there's one thing that happens in your household, all of the different pieces can, can come apart. And so that's again where we're able to be there and provide hope and help to families. Families like Francesca's. I'm just trying to show the kids that what we went through, you know, mommy's gonna definitely make up for it. Francesca says she's gonna do whatever she needs to to keep moving forward. And St. Vincent de Paul, they also work with their clients for a year to make sure housing remains stable. For more information or to apply, you can head over to our story on 11alive.com.